What's up, everybody? This is Afro Joe here. It's, I heard this story, man. I thought it was kind of fucked up. And I thought it was kind of just just screwed up, man. Cause uh, I actually got this story uh, from a, a dude I, I subscribe to, uh, and this story is about a mother. You see the mother's picture right there. It's about a mother named uh, Crystal Rusa. Rusa, and uh, she left her three kids home alone. And so she left her three kids home alone. That was uh, from the ages. Let me see. Because uh, one thing, uh, from the ages of f uh, four, three, and ten months old. Home alone, and when she left the man, when she left her kids home alone, the kids got out, and they found the kids on the highway. Now you probably something else like she left the kids home alone, and it was found on the highway. Where the fuck did she go? She went next door to her neighbor's house to fuck, and she went to sleep. She went next door. To get some get some dick, leaving her three kids at home and the boyfriend. She got a boyfriend that was out of town on because of work, out of town because of work. He found out from a damn reporter. Why did this man? Why did this woman's boyfriend had to find out through a damn reporter? Fucking popos didn't tell him. It was a reporter. But and it's kind of messed up that, that this woman this woman left her three fucking kids at home to go have sex with a neighbor and it, see that's neglect like a motherfucker and she's been charged with neglect child neglect and her kids been taken away from her amen hallelujah See, I'm telling y'all, man, these people today don't know how to raise a child. These damn people are leaving their kids home alone. People leaving their kids in the car and killing them. There was a there was a story down here where I'm in Tennessee, and this person left her baby in the van to go inside of a church to get some out of church, and the baby died from heat exhaustion because the damn van was heating up it because of the sun, the heat. The baby died and the woman neglected to take the child in. See, now this is what I'm talking about. Every year, like for the last few years, that's all I've been hearing about is parents leaving their kids in the car and in, in, in the hot sun. Parents forgetting their, uh, leaving their kids at home alone. Now this is bullshit that this woman set up here, <laughs> set up here, went across the next door to get some ass, get some dick. I mean, they say a witness. They say a witness uh, uh, saw the kids and, car, uh, and called the police, called the cops. The baby, the Timotho diaper was soaked when they discovered it was being cared by a four year old and they dodged traffic <laughs> and <coughs> excuse me and the oldest one's four years old but to, uh, that is something else the boyfriend didn't know what happened till the damn reporter called like I said man this is some this is some bullshit man I'm telling y'all People today, people today, people today. I'm telling you, man, motherfuckers can't take care of kids. I'm gonna put the story in the description box, but people today can't do, can't take care of no kids, man. Every time a child is born, you gotta think and wonder: Is these kids gonna live to see one or two or three years old? Because there's so many parents neglecting their kids today. 
that you don't know if they're going to live to see one, two, or three or four years old because one thing is you always going because I'm always hearing stories about kids about babies that are from a few months old to one years old to three four to three and four it don't even hit five it don't even hit five they don't even I ain't heard a five year old get killed but I heard from the ages of a few months old to four years old dying because the p parents neglect them I've heard of teen shootings now and then, but that's kind of like going down. Well, kind of teen shootings kind of going down, except teen suicides are going up. Same with parents neglecting their kids and killing them. Now this is bad that this woman sat there, left her fucking kids at home just to go get some go get some dick. Is dick that important to leave your fucking kids at home by themselves and they go? Go off on the highway, no freeway, no highway, whatever. It's bullshit. That this woman, she don't need kids, man. Just if I was, if I was a fucking judge, I said, bitch, you gonna spend five or six years in prison because you don't know how to raise kids. You holler. Once you get out, you're going on probation. You're going to parent uh, conference. I mean, parenting classes. After that. You still ain't gonna get your kids. That's how it is. I would not let this woman get her kids back. I just she does her sentence and all that. She I, I put it where she never gets her kids back. And it's just sad to say that this woman neglected her fucking kids just because she wanted to fuck. Just wanted to fuck, man. I know I know there's gonna be some people say gonna try to say something stupid out the way trying to talk it's it's about this woman and people still look I ain't bringing up race or nothing but it's stupid how this woman there's been parents there's been black and white parents that that kill their kids and it's getting to a point where man do people do do people really need to have kids because I it seems like every time a, a, a couple have kids or a woman have kids or a, fa or, or a man has kids, they end up dying quickly. Why is that? Why are these people killing their quick, killing their kids so quickly? That is the question I want. That is the answer. The question I want to know: Why are you killing your kids so quickly? That's all I want to know, man. T this has been Afro Joe Ten Like T A is. Tell me what you think about this whole situation a mother going next door to have sex leaving her three kids at home what do y'all think about it that's all I want to know this has been Afro Joe 10 like T.I.S. if you don't like what I got to say if you don't like what I got to say then fuck you and go to hell and, and shit if you like what I got to say tell me what you think about the topic about the topic only in a comment or video response, follow me on Twitter at Afro Joe the Wookie. Subscribe to my channel, CeeLo Jr. 2 and CeeLo Jr. 3. Peace, love, and so. And take care of your kids. Peace.